I've been in the, this forestry business for myself 65 years. Uh, I've seen the private wood destroyed, the marketing board destroyed, the private wood destroyed because of the Crown Land Act. Last year they lost $33 million. Our government selling our wood to these companies, they lost $33 million. So you know how much they got out of the wood? Not very much, eh? Nothing? Less than nothing? And uh, that makes private ground worth less than nothing too because how are you going to sell private ground when they're getting this wood for nothing? They don't even have to pay taxes. On my ground that I bought, I've got to pay taxes on it. Like I pay thirty, forty thousand dollars $40,000 a year taxes on my ground, which I can't even afford to cut the wood off it because it's not worth anything. It's just absolutely destroyed by the Caroline Forest Act. Thanks, Murray. One of our priorities in, the, in, in this uh, platform, in, this, in this, uh, this strategy, is to restore the 40,000 woodlots in this province as the primary source of supply for the mills in this province, so that that's where the wood comes from first, and that will provide a good rate of return for our woodlot owners. Every woodlot owner is uh, basically a business person, uh, running a small business, generating revenue, creating jobs in their communities, and they want to create jobs in their communities.